Cedar sinai is one of the largest deliverers of health care on the West Coast. We run a large primary care network, and at the same time, we also deliver the most complex, complicated quaternary and tertiary services, programs which really require the highest medical skill and talents in the nation. Cedar sinai has gone through a tremendous transformation. We went from a high-quality, community-based hospital to an academic powerhouse. One of the great advantages we have, of course, is living in one of the most wonderful and diverse cities in the country, and it doesn't hurt that the climate isn't too bad either. We are blessed by a great environment, intellectually as well as personally. We get nearly 200 applicants for every one of our residency slots, and that allows us to have the very brightest trainees who make our chances for continuing to push things forward and innovate even greater. General surgery really pulled me in because it kind of lets you fix any problem they're going to throw at you. You go into residency with kind of this one tract of, okay, I want to be a good surgeon, but then you come out and realize what it actually means to be a good surgeon. There's so many other parts to it. You know, the mentorship part of it, there's the support part of it, there's the personal skills and emotional intelligence side of it. I think we're unique as a program in, in a sense that we have designed our curriculum, that interns are operating as soon as they hit the hospital on their first day of internship, that they are already in the operating room learning the basics of surgery already. You're given autonomy to make clinical decisions of do we go to the OR or not, but if you aren't sure, you feel very comfortable turning to one of your attendings and say, listen, I don't know in this case, and I'm looking for guidance for this. And they're very happy to sit down and you know reason things through. We are one of six sites in the United States that are referred to as a catalyst program for robotic surgery, where our surgeons actually teach other surgeons and uh, robotic surgery and how to establish robotic programs at their institutions and we want to train residents that will be technically proficient in all types of surgery. Our residents have an extraordinary track record at uh, being awarded fellowships and research slots around the country when they complete, and more than 70% of our residents in general surgery go into academic medicine. The variety in the patient population here at Cedars has been a very great learning experience. You really are able to learn how to diversify your interactions with patients and how to really become more culturally aware and deal with some, some difficult patients, both socially difficult or emotionally difficult, and I think that's really important in, in training. There is some real um friendship and like camaraderie amongst the attendings and the residents uh, and that's I think the most important part of wellness here. And I think that's unique about Cedars and the culture that we have here where the senior faculty and even junior faculty are very comfortable with their relationships with residents and want to foster this environment of collegiality and camaraderie. There's no other place and no other people I'd want to go through this experience with than the people that I've met here and the relationships I've made and the family I've developed here. <laughs>